Jamie Lynn Spears knows exactly what she did. She's part of the reason why her sister was trapped in a conservatorship. She has tried her best to save her reputation. She has done podcasts like the Call Her Daddy podcast, which ended up backfiring, and she's tried to release a book. No matter what she does, people see her for what she is. She's ultimately an enabler in this conservatorship, and there should be justice, but Jamie Lynn is walking free. You guys know that she scammed her loyal Zoe 101 fans with her fake meet and greet and her fake reboot, a project that she put together to distract from the conservatorship, even though she wasn't willing to pay anyone, and we found out that Nickelodeon had nothing to do with this reboot. Well, after Jamie Lynn has had multiple failed projects, she has now moved on to a Fox reality television show, which I'm sure Britney Spears isn't happy about. Well, let's go ahead and get into it. Out of everything that could have happened today, I did not expect this because Jamie Lynn Spears is coming back to mainstream media through reality television. If you were to go and Google Jamie Lynn's name, you would see a bunch of headlines about this new reality show, a special forces training reality show that she's a part of. It's going to premiere on Fox and it's called Special Forces, The Ultimate Test where 16 celebrities will be dropped in the desert to train with a special forces team in a grueling endurance test. There are no votes, no eliminations, just survival. I don't know a single person who would subject themselves to something like this, let alone these celebrities. So I did a little bit of research about this show, and it turns out it's based off of another show, and it's filled with a bunch of different challenges to test their mental and physical strengths and to prove themselves what they're made of. You guys already know that I'm going to love to see Jamie Lynn in a boot camp setting, struggling, putting in physical labor. I mean, if we can't send her to a real boot camp, then I guess this is the next best thing. So this is a new show in the US, but it's not a new show. And the original show comes from the UK and it's titled titled SAS Who Dares Wins. So the show will premiere on Fox and it's dubbed The Ultimate Celebrity Social Experiment, which I think back to the one show, I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here. It's where they took a group of celebrities and put them on an island and allowed them to, I guess, fight for survival. This kind of gives me the same vibes, but it looks like this is a little bit more like militant boot camp oriented. And it looks like it's going to feature a bunch of people and NFL star named Danny. We've got one of the Spice Girls, Mel B, who I would not, I, I would be her friend in the show because I know she can fight, so I want to be on her side. I don't want her as my enemy. We've got The Bachelorette, Hannah Brown, which she's done so many different things. Like, The Bachelorette set her up with a full-time career. A TV chef named Tyler. We've got reality personality, Kate Goslin, who she needs her own video. An NBA star named Dwight. R&B singer named Mon tell a skier named gust we've got a gymnast it looks like we have a soccer player um a real housewife from atlanta named kenya moore tv doctor drew penske who he's a little bit toxic in my opinion but that's a whole separate video. We've got a Trump staffer, which is really random, and even more random, the Zoe 101 star Jamie Lynn Spears. Like, where did you come from? So we have a really, really um, interesting group of people who are going to be on this show. Some people are pretty notable. Some others, I'm like, where did they even find them. But these celeb contestants are going to be forced to take on training exercises led by directing staff agents Rudy Rays and Mark Billy Billingham, Jason Foxy Fox, and someone named Remy. They describe this group as an elite team of ex-Special Forces operatives. So, um... Maybe they'll be able to give Jamie Lynn a little bit of punishment for all the crap that she's been up to. The Tesla is a secret cat killer, and it's a problem that we've really got to fix. Um, we have now lost, I don't even want to tell you how many cats, because they don't hear the Tesla crank, and 
unfortunate things happen and it's really devastating and tragic for everyone involved so since the tesla is so quiet maybe he could like make one of those noises that like bother cat or animal ears when it cranks up so that way they know something's happening i must admit though i hate the way that TMZ has written about this, they started their article by writing, Jamie Lynn Spears is being put to the test, not just by her sister, Britney, but these reality show contestants. And I'm like, wait, really? You think that like Britney Spears is the troublemaker here that Jamie Lynn is being, you know, uh, tested by her sister at all times when it seems like Britney's being tested by her whole family, including her own children. But there's no doubt in my mind that this show is going to be intense and uh, Jamie Lynn is probably going to struggle. One celebrity who starred in the UK version of this show actually jumped from a helicopter and suffered severe injuries. Her name is Jennifer Ellison and she revealed that she was admitted to the hospital with a lung infection after surviving multiple injuries on this show. She said, after I jumped from the helicopter, I hit my ribs and I could feel pain in my side. When I got back to the UK, it was getting worse, so I went to the doctors. They told me, you've got broken ribs, blood in your lungs, and a bleeding spleen. The infection in my lung was really nasty. Hopefully, Jennifer is doing well nowadays, and it seems like Jamie Lynn has survived, so I don't think she's gone through anything like that. She's got to have survived because she's posted this photo, and she wrote in the caption, so excited that I can finally share about these life-changing experiences, the lifelong bonds I created with these amazing people during this process. No words can explain it. You just have to tune in to Fox TV, which I wonder if any of these castmates had any bad experiences with Jamie Lynn. She also posted this photo of these guys right here, and she shared a photo of someone jumping out of a helicopter. I would doubt it's her, but who really knows? She also made this story post, y'all, I can't believe some of the things I did. So hard, but so rewarding. <laughs> and so thankful for this group of people were bonded forever. And there, she shared that as well. Well, I wonder how Britney Spears feels about Jamie Lynn's new reality show, because um, I don't think there's really anything that she can do to save herself. I mean, remember she said she she was going to do a podcast at some point, but we haven't seen much of that. But I mean, if Jamie Lynn wants to come on my podcast, let me know, guys. I'm trying to wrap up my podcast so I can have it like come out by December time. So if you have anyone you want to see on my podcast, let me know or email me. Here's my email and I'll see you guys in a new video soon. Bye, guys.